Okay. And now we're ready to now we're ready to add. So we can go this plus this is this, right? And I've, I'm like storing them in, in like uh, uh, memory locations here. I'm making my own spreadsheet. I've got letters across here. Okay, when I do this, I get 12.29. Yeah. And when I go... Error undefined. Oh, come on. Oh, I see. Oh, there we go. I'm having calculator issues here. Okay, I think we're good now. That's funny, this calculator gives me an error so is it seven six? Is that what it is? Is that what you guys get? Yeah. Okay. My calculator gave me an error. I used a variable that I had not stored anything in, and it uh, like flagged that, which I think is kind of cool. Okay. So what is what is um, what is the equilibrium going to be? What do you add to this in the x to make x add up to zero? Is it negative twelve point two nine? Right. And what do you add to this to make this zero? Negative 22.76, right? Okay. So now, now we're now we're set. We can draw a picture of this guy, and then don't, you know, don't fall down. Don't don't make it through all of this stuff, right? And then not be able to draw the picture. So I'm going to go back 12.29 down 22.76. So there's 12.29 back. Notice I'm drawing this line longer. It helps to do that. Helps to make longer things longer. 22.76, okay? And then the final thing is what? That is the vector, yes? We gotta be able to draw the vector, okay? And the final thing would be to find this angle. Let's find this angle just for fun, yeah? So theta is tan minus one of 22.76 divided by 12.29. So opposite side over adjacent side. So uh, second tan of uh, 22.76 divided by 12.29, 61.6. So I guess we have two sig figs, so I'd have to say it's 62 degrees, right? And then uh, the magnitude of the equilibrant is the square root of... Uh, 12.29 squared plus 22.76 squared. Again, be very careful. I would not bother. You know that a negative number squared, right, is a positive number. So don't put the negatives in there, especially if you have a TI calculator because you've got to be very careful the way you do it. You've got to put it like in parentheses, and that's just way too much work for something you already know the answer to. Okay, alpha K squared plus alpha L squared. It'd be so cool if we had like little spreadsheets in this. Do you guys get 25.86? So like 25.9? Or I guess uh, 25.86. I, I, I get 26 newtons. So that's not so hard. Is that hard? Isn't it just adding vectors? Right? And the equilibrant, surprisingly, you know, is, is negative. You add up the vectors that you have. The equilibrant is negative the sum of the other ones, and of course now this adds up to, the final sum is that it adds up to zero, and zero newtons in the x hat plus zero newtons in the y hat, All right? And that is really a happy thing. It's an equilibrium. Isn't that beautiful? It's really beautiful, I think.